So, thank no, you. no, thank you. Yeah, the, uh, it's a black um, left hand drive one, with 20 printers a week. That's this one here. So, we'll do a walk around first on the outside. See the LED headlights, alloy wheels. So, this is at least the iconic. The, uh, the basic model only has steel wheels. And this is the boot space. I think these will be the cables, hopefully. Yeah, big fat things. That's the charging cables in there. But you see there's plenty of room for suitcase and so on. And then this is the what would be the driver's side, but at the moment isn't. Right, let's go for a sit. It's got two windscreen wipers, so Christine will be happy. <laughs> it says beep, beep, beep. Music. Checking in progress. Zeddy. It's actually got a film on top at the moment. But, uh, hello, user one. Language. It says uh, on the battery 39. 145, so I think that's 145 mile range. Now what I don't know is where you modify the settings or anything like that. Uh, there's an eco button just here, which I understand is the, the one you'd use around town. These are the air conditioning controls. There are three of them, but I don't know what they do at the moment. And then there's a start engine stop, which obviously I won't be pressing. <coughs> Setting up without one of the other guys here. You can't go anywhere. It's, uh, as uh, you can see, left-hand drive. Now, this is the voice commands, phones, and page selection, possibly. Oh, I see. I'm hoping that you can show me the the map up on there. This is the cruise control here. Uh, it has both cruise control and limiting. Um, so you can either you set it up as a limiter or a actual cruise control. All four windows electric on this one. I don't know which one it is at the moment. And then this is the um, the stick down here. Which has uh, reverse. Is it Colin? It is indeed. Oh, I'm Jack anyway. So Hello there, Jack's brilliant. arrived. Just a moment. Just there for the moment. <laughs> yeah, I um, understood. Yeah. Me and Ryan obviously will. Obviously, as soon as the face will come over and help, but obviously, hmm. this is the new Zoe, the brand new Zoe. What were your, what were your thoughts initially? Uh, well, it's, it's the increased range of the 50 amp hour battery I was mm. mainly interested in. Yeah, absolutely. Um, obviously, yeah, previously it was about 80, mi 80 miles range. The one so my brother had, yeah. The, yeah, I was on the, actually on the road, but you're looking sort of 220 plus with this one. Uh, yeah, it gives you yeah a lot that's more capability. not in the winter though. Of course, uh, yeah. 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 I understand it goes like from about 180 in the winter mm. to 220. Yeah. So yeah. I've been using the winter figures in my Zap map. In right, the yes. play. yeah. Um, I've set up some of the routes that we do. Yes, okay. We go to Manchester a lot. Okay. And because okay. uh, my son lives there. Mm. We go to Blackpool, we go to Lake District, but we also, we cruise, so we go okay. down to Southampton. Wow, okay. okay. Uh, and doing that looked quite fun. Yeah, I bet, yeah. Uh, my Very wife's good. not too impressed at the moment. Oh, but, that's um, all right. Good to come actually see them in the flesh, I think. Well, it's, see them online. Yeah, and it's, it's not actually seeing, it's worrying about plugging in and of course yeah uh, and the range mm. but um, I'm understanding that it'll probably do 
the entire journey to Manchester without any difficulty. Brill, brill. Obviously, with the, obviously the, the the batteries obviously take less time to charge now as all well the fast charging ports. You can actually get an mm. app on your phone as well, and that actually finds the nearest charging ports. Yeah, that, um, that's that map that I've been playing map, with. And, yeah. There's also they, um, share. Yes, but plug share's one. routing seems to uh, take you all over the place. All over the place. place, yeah. Whereas right. that map keeps you within your your range right. of the, the route. Mm. Oh, right. Mm. But yeah, obviously, in terms of obviously tech wise, it, it's, it's top of the range, obviously, with your easy link system. Um, it's basically a big eye. What I haven't I seen mean, yet is, yes, this one is what I wanted to see. I go okay on this one. So, in terms of your, your home screen, you have different users. So you could have, if you press Colin, and then your personal screen would come up. So you could have mm -hmm. the sat nav on the top, you could have the weather, you could have your phone book, whatever you sort of choosing. So every time yeah. you obviously yeah. use the car, I like it's it. personal to you. Um, in terms of it sort of flicks across, um, you've got your lane departure warning as a safety feature. So if you sort of, if you're on the motorway, you sort of hands go off the wheel and you start yeah, to Yeah, I believe the Ionique electric actually keeps you in lane. As well, yes, it just pulls, it just pulls slightly. you just slightly. Yeah, if you yeah. hands off the wheel. Basically, it's things if you um, if you're falling asleep, really. Um, let's put that back on. Not join it. For. Should reboot. If I um, if I go and grab the key quickly as well, mm -hmm. uh, because obviously in terms That's of the key car, doesn't it? Yes, it's, it's obviously it's, uh, <laughs> it's like obviously the, all, most of our cars are keyless at the moment. But the yeah. beauty of it is you're not sort of faffing around for a key really. You can just keep it on the car. Um, Jack, who's uh, one thing I've spotted on the stalks here, we have automatic headlights on this model. I don't know which model it is, and there's the two fog lights front and back. And on the other stalk, we've got automatic washers, uh, and like mine, different sensitivities on the auto washing, and then uh, different settings on the reverse one there as well. So, yes. <laughs> It looks like it's pretty similar to the uh, Toyota, but I don't know whether this is the top range or whether it's the middle one that I'm after. It is down here, uh, near the, the parking brake, isn't a handle, it's electric. So there's a button to say parking, and there's an A as well. I don't know what that is, if that's automatic button or something. But the parking brake is indicated by a red light. So that's slightly disconcerting, but I'm sure it'll work fine. And either this pad or this pad will be for your wireless charging of your phone. So all the time you're using it in here, it can be wireless charging. So it uses the phone for internet, I believe. Down here, there's an audio in, three and a half mil jack, two USBs, and a standard cigarette lighter to get you 12 volts. There's also some USBs in the back I noticed in uh, some videos I've seen. Um, it has Apple Play as well as uh, Android Play, whatever it's called. But it'll, it'll work with both Android and Apple phones, this one. You can get an idea of the room available in the back. Yeah. One of the other salesmen's uh, just made me a nice cup of tea, real tea, with real milk. So I'm going to sit and have that. This is the uh, charge connector. This is the two -pin, this is the three pin plug, sorry. It's a cable to a three pin plug, so it'll be very low rate of charge. And there you can see the different uh, connection options. The extra power connector the, for the rapid charge is at the bottom there. You can see piano keys for lane divert alert is the um, I think that's whether or not you have a limiter ah, there's a bulb but it might be the panel brightness uh, that one is the uh, dip, dip angle for the different weights and this one on the end here is the one that opens yeah. the flap at the front unlocks the flap, the flap at the front not sure what that one is, might just turn off notifications but it's a speaker with a off. <laughs> sat here since 10 o'clock okay, sure. and he said he had a handover that would take 20 minutes, half an hour. But it's now quarter past 11. 
Well, I've got a zero here, which I've never had before, so... <laughs> oh, right, so let's get the cable Just off. Just cable. Oh, it's because it's on charge. Oh, yeah, because you can't walk. Yeah. You yeah. don't want to drive around with it hanging out. <laughs> you have to remove the cable. But we've now got the uh, display lit up with zero miles per hour. Thrill. Yeah, that would have been, been tough otherwise. That's all. Vehicle there check in are. progress. Aha, there we are. Ah, obviously, it's to move the wheel, that's all. So, obviously, this is the brand new ZE technology as well. It's the sort of easily. Which version is this? This is the GT line. Ah, it is the one. top one. Yes, yeah. I'm not sure I can gain. afford that. Um, but obviously, the things obviously you'd, you'd sort of gain, obviously, is that sort of larger screen. Um, and obviously, this is the 9.3 inch screen with the Easy Link system. And it's also the 135 um, 35 off my horsepower head. thing. Yes. Um, it's basically like a big iPad, really. Um, obviously, mm. it's brand new technology. What it's got, obviously, application wise, obviously, it's fully touch screen. Um, you've got your navigation, obviously, your full obviously your Tom Tom Sat Nav, which updates yep. itself. Um, you've got your radio, obviously, and your music as well. Where does it update itself from? Is that from your phone? Just from, there's no like, SD cards anymore needed for them. Right. It's completely, Renault, Renault will do it, obviously, online themselves. If there's an update. Yeah, what I mean is, is it, is it connected to um, Renault through its own cell phone system? It's, or yeah, does it use your phone? It can, it can do it can do either obviously it has its own there's like it has its own like wi-fi so you can find sort of nearest restaurants etc you can google things um, if you mm -hmm. wanted to um, so it's actually got its own sort of wi-fi network um obviously you can use your phone to sort of um sort of go to it as well yeah i mean if you're in the middle of the country where's it getting the signal from i'm not obviously not i'm not sure really <laughs> um i have, have to have a look at that one um because you presumably you pay a, a tariff for the rate for the phone Part, not not know. not for not for this part. No, you wouldn't you wouldn't you wouldn't really? pay one. No, no. Um, so that's, obviously it's all, all sort of included. Oh, it's on EA already with that. Yeah, the yeah. data there, the blue. Because I know that there's a, a wireless pad somewhere. And hit this one. That's that obviously, one. Yeah, the, it comes, the comes wireless as an, charging as pad. an extra. You can get it as a pack. Yes. Um, yeah. So, have you got an iPhone yourself, or is it like a? Mine's an Android, but it does both. I understand. Right. Yes. So if you, this, obviously, the, with the um, Apple, it's just a um, plug in. It'll come up, and then with the Android, you just get a little app. You get a little app down there, mm. and you literally you put, plug it in the USB, plug it into your phone, and then you put your phone will just ping to this. Obviously, yeah. so you can just say, "Hey Google," um, which is obviously a similar button to this one here. Yeah. yeah. So it's just like a Siri button. Hey Google, take me to Glasgow, and it will take you to Glasgow. Obviously, it'll get all come up with the with the navigation. Not quite the you. same way as a Tesla would. <laughs> yes, I mean they're, they are. Yeah. <coughs> High tech. But I, I'm too scared. I was too scared of that. Yeah. People chopping their heads off and things because ah. they used it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, scary indeed. It drove them under a lorry. Yeah, yeah. Um, obviously, in terms of obviously the Easy Link system as well, everyone has like their own user as well. So when you're, yep. so you can have Colin. Every time you turn the car on, you can press Colin, and this home screen would be tainted towards you. Mm -hmm. So you'd have the weather there. You can make the navigation a bit smaller. You can have well, phones. Well, that persuade Christine to go in it yet? I don't know. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Well, I'm sure, sure the, um, the grandchild will love it. Because she has Radio 2. Is that, is that, is that I, I a, must, a die hard Radio 2 yeah. fan? Yes, she, she is. Oh, right. she is. Okay. So every time we're driving anywhere, it's Radio 2. No, oh, right. Okay. And I'm sort of virgin chill. Yeah, smooth. I don't mind a bit of smooth. It's pretty cool. Well, yeah. virgin chill is yeah. good because uh, it's calming music, right. which is good for driving. Mm. Yeah. You can sometimes yeah. you get a bit carried away with some of the. Yeah, yeah. Other stations. Yeah, I know what you mean. Know right. You mean. Obviously, you've got your, down here, you've got your eco mode. So, obviously, that will sort of cut the power slightly, mm. um, but will sort of help your range. I'd recommend it around sort of urban driving. Um, probably not yeah. so much on My the My understanding motorways. from the website, mm. uh, the range calculator, is that it actually turns itself off if you get to, it can start going really if fast. It, yes, it, obviously, it, if you start going to the motorway, it's something like over. I can't off the top of my head, I'm not sure. 50 or 60 um, maybe. Yeah. Yes, it'll be That's about that speed. Yeah. Um, well, it'll just obviously know itself. Because I, I tried to use eco mode, uh, saying we're going at 70, mm. and it, it wouldn't turn on, yeah. on on the website. Yeah, yeah. But as I said, obviously, with, with the mm. new easy, it sort of swipes like an iPad as well. So you're swiping right, obviously, yeah. this is your sort of safety features, really. So you've got your lane departure assist, obviously, like we said. Um, so you're going on the motorway. Now, is that in all versions? 
I'm not sure actually. I can I can find out for you. Because the one I'm looking at is the middle one, which mm. is the 110 engine. Okay. Which presumably uses less uh, electric as well. Yeah, yeah. From the battery. Yeah. yeah. Um, but should add enough power for a motorway. Yes. Yeah. I, I can have a look for you. This is only my mm. this is my second month at the moment, so I'm still still learning lots <laughs> as well. Yeah, learning, learning lots together. Learn, eh? uh, yeah. Obviously, you still get your blind spot warning as well. Some in your blind spot, you can obviously turn that on to get it to beep. Um, obviously, you can activate it. Mm, I know that's an option, but I think it might be in the middle one as well. Yes. Um, I- Iconic or something. Iconic, is it? Iconic. Like that. Yeah, yeah, the middle one. Yeah. Um, I can always have a, we always have a look at the brochure as well and say exactly what's well what finance wise I don't I don't want the basic one because it's missing some features that I would like what are sort of the must needs for you in, in the car then what are like the, the have to have uh, well it's the sat nav and any safety features I can get right okay no problem I'd love auto um, adaptive cruise control I don't believe it has it the, the, on this one here if I show you that's a so, normal cruise yes, control limiter yeah, but it won't actually you understand you, yes so yeah. cr- Cruise control at the top. Oh, no, that's a I've been following well. a lot of people on YouTube that have Zoys and things, but right. earlier versions, obviously. Okay. Okay. Uh, and vlogs of those people. Very good. Have you got a YouTube channel yourself, have you? Hmm? Have no, you got, no. Have you oh, right. Now I've got right. Toyota. Oh, right. Yaris Hybrid. Okay. So um, their hybrid still uses a significant, on, journey, on longer journeys, it still mm. uses a significant amount of fuel. Right, okay. So we can chop, knock that on the head. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So, if you say sat nav is obviously a big one for you. Obviously, you any sort of safety. Yeah, because we go a lot of places um, that are different to, you know, we find odd hotels here and there with good mm. deals on. Yeah, of course. Of course. In Warwickshire, um, we've done Cheshire and all over the Cheshire, place. Yeah, I went to university in Chester. I graduated in November. Ah, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah so we love Chester. Part, We've been a couple of times. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? And it's not far from my son in Manchester. Oh, right. So, sort of, yeah, it's, well, yeah, it's so we always drive, see him on the way home or whatever, you know. It's, uh, it's a lovely part of the world. It is. It's, mm. it's a really nice part of the world. Um, tell us more on this as well. If you want to sort of, in terms of add a widget, you can change, obviously, what you want in your home screen. So you have your navigation, right. petrol station is near, you can have parking. You does it do it. fuel prices? It does. It does. That's similar to that, what? Obviously this Although we're not using fuel so. for connectivity, but it's, it will yeah. be um, near um, nearby pumps, etc. Charging yes. points. Yes, that would just be the Renault ones, I believe. Ah, at the moment, yes. Right. Um, so that map is still yeah. useful. Let me have a, <laughs> yes, absolutely. The app on the phone, what would recommend anyway? Have a look. Obviously, that's still with the at the moment. That's your connection. It's got it's got it's got its own built-in connection. Um, yeah, I understand. I saw EE pop up there. Mm. Right. Which is a cracking feature. Other feature, obviously, in terms of car info. And yeah, my Toyota, I have to connect to my phone. Yeah, obviously, you can, it's, yeah, you still have obviously that Bluetooth connection as well. Um, but that that, um, that sort of Android connection you can do, the, the Hey Google, is a, mm. is a great feature. Um, especially, sort of, yeah. you can mess around with your phone while you're driving as well. You yeah, say, send a message to um, so and so and all this. And that's obviously, say, oh, so and so sent you a message, what do you want to yeah. send back? And you go, oh, I love you too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I'll be late for dinner. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll be back in an hour, eh? <laughs> obviously, it's, obviously, on the application as well, you can sort of put videos on your phone on. Obviously, if your phone was connected, um, mm. you can have, obviously, yeah, photos as well, etc. Yeah. Um, so there's a lot of tech, obviously, on there. Um, Although you wouldn't watch videos while you're driving, of course. Of course. If you're stuck nice somewhere. Think, though, yeah, 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 of course. Um, could be me and Christine in the front, so yeah. we could both watch your videos. Oh, right, very good. When's the, when's the next sort of big... Social outing then? Have you got anything planned soon? Or? Uh, we're going to. <laughs> we're supposed to be going to Vienna. Oh right, in April, very nice. But Vienna's just had the a coronavirus a, last night. Yeah, yeah. Oh dear. Mm. So it may not be on. I'm not sure yet. Right. We'll have to contact Italy, our yeah, supplier. Uh, yeah. It's becoming a problem at the moment. Austria, that is. Austria, Austria. Yeah. But it's just happened in Austria. They've got yeah, three cases. One in Vienna. Wasn't there a school? They wanted to get a school shut down, didn't they? Well, there's a, there's a, uh, there's something so, about a ski resort, and there, and there is like yeah. two and a half two and a half hours apart, and yeah. Mm. yeah. So I don't know what's going on there, but we need to um, find out. Yeah, I'm sure you'll I'm sure you'll work it out anyway. Uh, and then we've got a cruise in October. Nice. Which means so Southampton. Yeah. So obviously. Getting there is obviously. Yeah, well, the hybrid not a problem. We should put it in the map. Yeah, have a go. Let's put it in, shall we? It's Eastleigh that we go to, which is a hotel. Uh, where we can park the car, right? And they um, ferry us in. Do by any chance? It's up your head. It should be like just put Eastley, Eastley. city, Eastley. Eastley. Yeah, it's Eastley Holiday and Express. 
L E I G H. Oh, East. L E I. There you are. Eastly. I presume it's Hampshire. Yeah. I should have thought so. Yeah, obviously you can. So I'll show you that. Where is it going to send us? Eh? For part for charging. Let's have a look. But if this only has Renault ones, then we're going to be... Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure what's going on. I'm going to have to check that for you. Yeah. There the we are. The has been calculated. Please drive onto a digitised road. There we are. Obviously, it seems obviously it looks to be the best route, obviously. Yeah. Um, yeah. How, how many miles? That one? 169 kilometres. Um, so oh. it says it won't make your... I was going to say that should be in miles. Yeah. Let's have a look. There we go. We'll be able to change. No, well, I'll change the, yeah, oh, right. it will be in setting that's obviously yeah. to be able to change it. This mm. little um little limiter there, so obviously that will give you the, the speed limit of the road yeah. you're on. Yeah, my, my camera my in here. One does that. Yeah, so obviously yeah. there's another safety feature it can obviously keep you keep it at a proper speed if you Oh that, that recognises uh, local ones as well, like my Toyota does. Yes, yes it will. Brilliant. It'll do I'm all, not all the losing any on. safety features. Yeah, yeah. Um yeah. so you, yeah, you want, you want to obviously keep it keep The it trouble with them in the UK is that mm. they detect twenty mile an hour pedestrian sign, uh, signs ah, for schools right. yeah. that don't mean it because they're not lit. Because they're actually, yeah. Uh, ah, right. Flashing or Trouble anything. Trouble with a little, little So little it turns you do 20 off. and you're doing 30. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. But yeah, obviously that, that's obviously, it's, in terms of the large green as well, it's obviously a, a lot easier to see. Yeah, so um, that would actually navigate us to all the way to the Eastleigh. It would, yeah. But it would also tell us when we're running out of fuel. And, yeah, yeah, and yeah obviously you have your charge, etc. on there as well. Um, yeah. On that, obviously. Which, oh, the 39 and 140 somewhere has turned there down, down here now, so it was up there before. You see the little blue, that, that little blue bar? So when yeah. that's at the top, that'll be 100% obviously, and that'll come mm -hmm. down accordingly. Um, yeah, well, it, when you're moving, you only charge it up to 80, don't you? Yeah. So maybe, yes. Because you have fast chargers, yeah. you don't yeah. charge to 100 with yeah. a fast charger. Yeah, you want it, obviously, you want it so fast. So it should go between 80 really. and 20. Mm. Mm. And when you get to 20, you think about getting some. Yeah. But, as I say, that should be all handled on here, telling you where you're going to be stopping. Yeah, I'll show you. Have you got all those changes? So if you type in reachable area, that's as far as you can go with the charge you've got. See that map there? Ah, yeah. See that little edge. So the mm -hmm. car's got 38% charge left, and that is that little outline is where. So the blue is definite, and the green. So is the like end it. of our blue line is as far as we get on our route. Yeah, correct. With the charge we've got, obviously. Yeah, yeah. You obviously, you can see, you see say, what what sort of mode can I go in? Obviously, blue. I'm just a standard. If I want to go eco mode, though, I can get no, a little bit further. You can't go further. on the motorway anyway. Of course, it'd be all motorways. Gonna, you, you would struggle power wise, maybe. Mm. Um, Another option there for you, but it's quite, it's quite a good feature obviously with having that reachable area map. So that's yeah. just on this one here, obviously. Charging stations, if you press that one. That's the one, yeah. And there we go. So obviously, in terms of routes as well, you can oh, well off the squeeze route, this one it? out as well. You can have a look, obviously, charging stations, etc. Just to get a bit, get a bit of power as well. Um, if you look down here, obviously, you can obviously go to anything sort of near as well. Obviously, it'll show you how fast the Weatherby. charging ports are. It's one we use. Mm. We stop off at Weatherby, but whether we need it charging by there, it's only 70k, mm. 30 odd miles. Yeah, you could sort of so top up we, potentially, but uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, but we don't. We only we only go for like um, maybe a bit slice of toast or something. Of course, yeah, yeah. It's always you have a break in the coffee, isn't it? Though? And then mm. if we went to Manchester at least, it would be Birch, but mm. it wouldn't be Manchester for Southampton. Yeah, of course, of course. Real. Yeah. It's all along in terms there. Of, obviously, in terms of tech, it is there. So it's what you to find. Press that. That's the option. Route route and nearby, which is good. There we are. So what you sort of nip off, of, but yeah, you've got the option. The option's there for you. So there's these three little dots as well. Mm. But yes. So how long, obviously, right. what other sort of hobbies do you have? <coughs> When's the next sort of. So obviously, you've got the cruise coming up as well, but. I go, when will you know about that? My, my hobbies include uh, a model railway okay. electronic group, okay. Very which good. Uh, I'm a ch secretary of, okay. and we have meeting every two months Very in either North Shields right. or Jarrow. Okay. And, okay. Uh, I believe I can go there and back with the, with, with the full charge one. Real. Um, oh, I used to, uh, in Leyburn, you know where Leyburn is, by, yeah. in sort of, oh, where was yes, that over by Ri R Richmond. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, 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 there's,
in, the, in, in terms and of the radio amateur emergency network, right. go all over the place. Yes. For uh, exercises and things, mm. for walks, uh, bike rides, right. that kind of thing. Okay. So uh, it was very useful for that. To have it, yeah, obviously. Because um, it's obviously, yeah. Just do um, northerly, westerly. Does it last, last long? In terms of the sat nav destinations. I should do it. Let's find out, shall we? Yeah. What can we buy we go back to home or we'll get navigation? Navigation. To be under address or menu? Just point of interest it says. Point of interest. Try menu. Your print will let If we go reach for it, was it point of interest? No, it's not a point of interest. It'd be not that long. See, Obviously, you can find. Obviously, what you wanted to, if you're on the road as well, if you wanted to find, obviously, reach areas you've got. If you wanted to find a station, you've obviously got electric stations there as well. Yes, um, yes. that's good. Yeah, I'm unsure actually. That one. Have you got your traffic Maybe it's under. Well? It could be under find an address. Mm. What was the? Uh, uh, house number. Coordinates. There you are. There we are. Ah, yes. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, it can do it then, because Brilliant. what we get is uh, normally NZ whatever. Yeah. Because yeah. our boss is... Obviously, uh, use a, a GPS that's got oh, that stuff in. Yeah. But you can easily convert it. Mm. And sometimes it comes up with the lat long as well. Yeah. Or yeah. you can just bug it in. He has a website that bug, bugs it out. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, I can put Northerly Westerly in. Brilliant. Yeah. At least you've got that, obviously, there. Obviously, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm still there with those units. You can change as well with that. Um, well, obviously, there's suggestion of location, the first one. Well, you get suggested areas as well. Um, but obviously, the, the main thing I liked, obviously, with that is that obviously the size of the screen is a, it's just easy mm. for uh, accessibility. And I'd be getting a really. seven inch, wouldn't I? A bit smaller. I believe, yes, yes. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna sort of confirm that with you. Um, yeah. You know, I'm sort of learning as well as you are, really, Charlie, <laughs> eh? Um, uh, so space wise no. as well, everyone's still. In terms of the cabin, everyone's still got quite a bit of space, I thought, felt for quite this, a small This range cabin. thing is very mm. important. Um, when the range, when you go faster, mm -hmm. the range goes down. Does it show it going down on here? Or does it assume you're going some economical speed? It will go, it will put the range down accordingly. Right. Yeah. Because I understand as well from the, the calculator on the website, yeah. that it drops down about 140 or so at 70 miles an hour in the winter. Right, okay, so quite, quite I put a bit. like oh, nice. realistic winter temperature in mm. and 70 miles an hour, and it's about 140 miles an hour. Right, okay. So that, that obviously, the, the weather will affect it, of course, mm. um, being a battery, obviously, electric vehicle, but um, obviously, obviously, it's just sort of personal preference to people. Some people, oh, I can't go that far with just. Actually, it's high An interesting bus. figure for you. Which one uh, of the 110 and the 135 motors, which one does 70 better? Which one uses less electric? Will it, be, one, will it be 135? Yeah. yeah. Which one? one I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure, both. actually. Hmm. Yeah, I'll divide out for you. Because that would show whether it's because of the, the, the times that we do go uh, motorwaying, we need to yeah. know whether we're going to use too much electricity. Right, oh, nice, yeah. Obviously, you must obviously range is obviously a real. It's sort of it has been a fear for people, but the security of having it obviously up on your, on your dashboard, mm. the security of finding them so close, there's sort of there is that finding sort of nearby ones and all. Yeah, the rest there of is it. that sort of comfort in knowing you you yeah. you won't run out. Um, Indeed. Yeah. In terms of obviously steering wheels, obviously this behind here, you can sort of change radio channels just for that one. Volume as well, obviously on and off and mute. Yeah. Obviously, you change the source as well accordingly. We sort of obviously with it with still being when we're driving car. usually Christine sorts out the radio. Right, well, she, so she's she can, DJ. She can do it on there, can't yeah, she? Yeah, yeah. She's, she's DJ. in charge of the uh, of the entertainment. Of course, of course. <laughs> I just <laughs> concentrate on the drive. Yeah, that's all right. Hey, you're a yeah. team, aren't you? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. That way. Cool. And she also supplies the wine gums. Uh, vital, vital. Absolutely. Uh, you can't go wrong with wine gum. Hey. So I understand the cruise control. That's nice and straightforward. Yeah. What's this one on this side? So on this side, on the top left, you've got your obviously your phone. So your phone was connected to the car. If someone mm -hmm. was to ring you, it'd come up, and who was ringing? You could answer the phone with that one. And you could also put the phone down with that one. Yeah. This one here is like a, a Hey Google or Siri button. Yeah. Um, in which you could obviously text back. You could ring people. You could obviously. You can also instruct you to take your places. Can you? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So that that's, um, that that's looks like a multiple page thing. I show you. That, and this, the, this, this, this bit here controls your computer here, so you can obviously get up All and down, right. tyre pressure. You can put a journey in, you can put, right. obviously, how your fuel consumption comes up, 
Oh, nice. In terms of killer, what That's the MPGE, is it? Yes, yeah. Mm. I've heard so about that. Obviously, you can change of which what you want up as well. You can change radio station with that. Obviously, that like compass. Right. Um, so yeah, it switches pages and then that switches the value on the page. Correct, yeah. Just like my Toyota, that's yeah. fine. Yeah. <laughs> obviously, with, with, obviously, with a fully charged one, you can obviously you have that a bit brighter, but obviously, quite, obviously it's got a little mm-hmm. protective layer on at the moment. Um, oh, you yeah. protect it, yeah. It's, yeah not just of good. course. Um, but yeah. Right. Um, this looks pretty straightforward as it's well. It's obviously full climate control. Um, you can m- more intense for your. Yeah. Fan. You haven't got an auto on the fan. On the, if you press that one, that'll. Ah, back it, yeah. Smash it. And you can sync it as well, obviously. Obviously, that is where you want the fan. Have you got left and right, or just one temperature? Just one. Just mm. the one for that one. Because the Toyota's um, got dual. Yeah, that, there's just the, just the one in this one. Obviously, temperature, intensity, and where you want Direction. it. Direction, obviously, of course. Um, you have to not fall out over it, that's all I say. <laughs> You've got to be no, fine. We, we are uh, one degree different at the moment. No, all right. I'm one degree warmer than Christine right. does. She's be, always she'll feels be hot, she'll the, be cold. Yeah. 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 Obviously, in terms of obviously, you've got your auxiliary cables as well, your, your two USBs in case you both want to charge your phone as well. Yeah. Obviously, that's yeah. your cigarette lighter as well, if you've got another device for that. Mm. Um, yeah. Now, in terms of obviously, your gear shift as well, it's a cracky looking, I think. It, it looks gorgeous. I mean, yeah. it's, um, Looking wise, was that, was they, oh, that pushes park? up and pulls down. Um, if you're not quite sure you want that one. I see there's the, there's yeah, that, that's the there. parking brake, yeah. but where's, where's the park? It usually you have a park lock. Just on any oh, oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Weird. Because I have a P position on there, yeah. PRND, and then I have a B separate. So what's yeah. the D stroke B do then? What's that so about? That obviously, that was that puts you in drive. Oh, sure I know what B is. Yeah. It's it's a it's a brake where you use single foot, and when you let go, it uses more regeneration for braking. Oh right. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, and I'd love that mode because it's it's the leaf mode. The right. Leaf does yes. It. Yes. It's similar. It's default, then, yeah. And a couple of the other ones do it quite well. well you, know, you know more than me, Colin. You're a, you're an expert. Yeah. <laughs> What's the extra down here? That, that's just in which to pull it, I believe. Oh. It just moves accordingly like that, obviously. If yeah. that, like, oh, I see, it's a toggle. Just up and down, just like that. Right. Um, yeah. It doesn't go do 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 No, it's just a toggle. Right. So it's just yep. the same place. Fine. Um, but yeah, look wise, I think it's cracking, obviously. And it's under here as well. You've got a bit more space, etc. Yeah. Um, Put your money. Exactly. For the yeah, toll yeah. or whatever. For the toll bridge yeah. going to North Shields. <laughs> right, so. Need, obviously, for all that. Um, Electronic handbrake, or obviously parking brake. That'll yeah, chop the car on a hill weird. as well. Um, yeah, but it's still slightly weird. In terms of, it gets yeah, it's tough getting used to it, obviously. Um, but yeah, that's obviously your stop start as well. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah, auto that on the stop start on and off. Because it looks like it's auto brakes. Yeah, yeah. Actually, mm. might be yeah. Um, yeah. Oh. Well, so parking brake push down to take it off. Pull up, obviously it'll, it'll oh, feel the pull car. Pull up like, like a handbrake. Just, yeah, just like hand, a mini handbrake right. really. Yeah. And it will obviously, on a hill it will chock the car and obviously give you, give you a time to sort of push off really as well. Um, Excellent. So you're not worried about that really. Um, right, so I think the only thing left to do is to talk about, well I can see the, this one here, the right hand one. Yes. Isn't that, um, to recharge there. On the left, and yeah, then the power the up there. Yes, yeah. something like that. That's very similar to a hybrid. If you thing. see on the bottom right, that's in watch. In what, what gear you're in as well? Ah, just that's where it is. I was looking for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yes. But obviously, if I if I could, I can show you obviously the physical um, sort of brochure and what you gain and lose with each model in terms mm. of spec. Um, and you've got. I've seen that on the website, but yeah. I wasn't sure. Yeah, and it's best that you come have a look here. It's got what I need, course. and I wish it is to get the extra bits. Mm, of course. <clears throat> right, should we go and discuss? Let's do it, let's do it, Colin. That looks good. It's a Zeddy Go. Oh, it's a Zeddy 50 electric, because it's the 50 amp hour kilowatt hour one. Wow. And that's with the, show the brake lights. I presume, is that one of those uh, scary <laughs> That's, Yeah, in terms of indicator wise, they are. <laughs> yeah, can you turn that feature off and just make it flash flash? <laughs> so it like all it? Going, <laughs> I think it is just the, yeah. Oh, it's the new right. tech colour, it's the new tech. Obviously, it's sensitive as well. Ah, lovely. Yeah, because yeah, that's optional, though. Yes. You have to make yeah. sure that's optional. A parking pack, yeah. 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 
because I have had issues um, bumping into things. Right, so is that one for you? Yeah. 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 Right, let's have a talk. Let's do it.